In the 41st chapter of this book of Ezekiel, you know what we see? We see God's great attention to detail. We, we see in this chapter great design details given to the temple, how it is to be set in order. And it reminds me of a New Testament verse. Maybe you'll remember this from the uh, experiences that the early church was going through. And when things were a little bit, I know you may not know this about church, but at least in the first century, a little unorganized, a little disorderly, a little chaotic. And Paul wrote to the early church in 1 Corinthians 14, let all things be done decently and in order. You know, as you're walking with the Lord, I believe he likes us, he calls us, he desires us, he wants us to walk with him in ways that are decent and in order, but also rhythmically, where, where you make it part of your lifestyle to be in God's word, to gather with his people to worship him, to group with his people, to connect together, and to go with his people to preach the gospel and make disciples. I believe he desires you to kind of live that order of life, very rhythmic, if it were. And let me share this with you. As you walk with the Lord, I believe you can choose to be rhythmic or random. And I don't believe there's anything spiritual about random. That's why Paul writes in 1 Corinthians 14, 40, let all things be done decently in order. That's why here in Ezekiel today, you're reading about the great attention to detail that God gives for his temple. So no matter what's under your care today, your stewardship, your oversight, let everything done today be done decently and in order.